going up against Diamond Stone and three-time state defending champion Dominican. And although Mineral Point kept it a close game in the first half, a fourth straight gold ball is returning home to Dominican. Real proud of our guys. I thought we battled. You know, I thought it was a basketball game, and I'm not sure how many people thought going in this would be a game today. I don't think we played timid. Uh, we came out from the gate looking to shoot the ball, and we were hitting, knocking down some shots, but uh, just got away from us a little bit. You're not undefeated by accident, so we knew coming in that they are going to give us a battle. You know, they had four really good shooters. They moved the ball really well on offense. The Pointers made it a four-point game late in the first half after a size staver three, but Stone and others outscored point 40 to 21 in the second half to put the game out of reach. That was a tough thing, and not only so many other guys that can hurt you, but hurt you in different ways. They're multidimensional. Looking up at the scoreboard, we saw seven, and I was like, we can, we can work with this a little bit, and then, but we knew they were going to come out in the second half and they're gonna come out fast, and we try to counter it a little bit, but it just start slipping away from us. We start missing perimeters, they start hitting. You win with good people, and these are great people, and uh, to try to replace them is gonna be something we're not gonna think about here for a little bit. With all five starters being seniors, Mineral Point will have a lot of rebuilding for next year. But today, Championship Saturday, is all about receiving their hardware from an unforgettable season. Reporting from the Pole Center, Eric Jacobson, News 3 Sports.